Today, we're diving into the latest and greatest from Samsung, the highly anticipated Galaxy Z Fold 6 and Galaxy Z Flip 6. These foldable smartphones are set to be revealed on July 10, 2024, and we've got all the juicy details thanks to some exciting leaks and rumors. Let's explore the three major upgrades that make these devices stand out in the market. Are you ready? Let's get started. The Samsung Galaxy Z Fold 6 and Z Flip 6 have been the talk of the tech world, and for a good reason. With foldable phones becoming more popular, Samsung continues to lead the charge in innovation. According to a well-known tipster, Even Blast, we now have a sneak peek at the main specs and features of these new foldables. While some online critics argue that these specs are a downgrade, there are three underrated upgrades that we think are worth celebrating. First up, let's talk about durability. The Galaxy Z Fold 6 and Z Flip 6 are expected to come with an IP48 rating from dust and water protection. This might not sound like a big deal at first, but it's a significant improvement from last year's IPX8 rating. So, what does this mean? An IP48 rating means these phones are not only protected against water, but also have formal dust protection. This is a first for foldable smartphones. Many of the competitors, like the Vivo X Fold 3 Pro and the Motorola Razr 50 Ultra only have an IPX8 rating, which means they don't offer official dust protection. Even the OnePlus Open only has an IPX4 rating. So Samsung's move to an IP48 rating is a huge step forward, making these devices more durable and reliable for everyday use. Next, let's talk about the display. There were rumors that the Galaxy Z Flip 6 would feature an IPS LCD cover display, which disappointed many fans. However, according to Sam Mobile, this was just a typo. Both the Galaxy Z Fold 6 and Z Flip 6 are expected to come with stunning ANOLED screens. But that's not all. Samsung might also announce a brighter display this year with a peak brightness of 2600 nits, similar to the Galaxy S24 Ultra. This means you can expect vibrant colors, deep blacks, and excellent visibility even in bright sunlight. The switch to AMOLED displays ensures a premium viewing experience, making everything from watching videos to playing games more enjoyable. Now, onto performance. The Samsung Galaxy Z Fold 6 and Z Flip 6 are set to feature the powerful Snapdragon 8 Gen 3 processor. This is the same processor used in the Vivo X Fold 3 Pro, and it promises to deliver lighting fast performance and efficiency. In addition to the new processor, Samsung is also expected to increase the RAM options to 8GB and 12GB. This upgrade will ensure smoother multitasking and better overall performance. While the internal storage options haven't been announced yet, we can expect these devices to run on Android 14 with Samsung's One UI 6.1, providing a seamless and user-friendly experience. With these impressive upgrades, the excitement for the Galaxy Z Fold 6 and Z Flip 6 is at an all-time high. These foldable smartphones are set to redefine the market with their enhanced durability, stunning displays, and powerful performance. Are you excited for the Z Fold 6 and Z Flip 6? Let us know in the comments below. Now let's switch gears a bit and talk about another exciting product from Samsung, the Galaxy Buds 3 and Galaxy Buds 3 Pro. We have two quick unboxing videos from a new source in Dubai showcasing the white and gray models. These videos confirm Samsung's switch to a stem-style design for the Galaxy Buds 3, complete with an LED strip on each stem. The stem's angular design is a fresh take, differentiating these earbuds from Apple's offerings. While Samsung hasn't officially revealed the Galaxy Buds 3 and Galaxy Buds 3 Pro yet, someone has already purchased a pair of the Pro version and has shared detailed pictures on Reddit. These images give us a close look at the new earbuds, including the redesigned charging case, which looks stylish and modern. According to the user who shared the pictures, the bass on the Galaxy Buds 3 Pro is strong and the noise cancellation is comparable to the first generation Apple AirPods Pro. However, this is just one person's opinion and we'll need to test the earbuds ourselves to see how well they perform. The new design and features of the Galaxy Buds 3 Pro are definitely intriguing and we can't wait to get our hands on them to give you a full review. So, there you have it. The exciting upgrades coming to the Samsung Galaxy Z Fold 6 and Z Flip 6, as well as a sneak peek at the new Galaxy Buds 3 and Galaxy Buds 3 Pro. These innovations from Samsung are set to make a big splash in the tech world, and we can't wait to see them in action. That's it for today. What are your thoughts on these new devices? Let me know in the comments section. As always, see you in the next video. Today, we've got some exciting news about Samsung's upcoming foldable smartphones. If you're a tech enthusiast, you're definitely going to want to stick around for this one. We're talking about the highly anticipated Galaxy Z Fold 6 series, and more specifically, the Galaxy Z Fold 6 Ultra, which is rumored to be coming to China and Korea. Let's dive right in. 
Among the many Galaxy Z Fold 6 models that are currently in development in Samsung's labs, the one that has everyone buzzing is the Galaxy Z Fold 6 Ultra. Now, if you're familiar with Samsung's ultra-branded smartphones, you know they are designed to be the best of the best, offering high-end features and cutting-edge technology. While the standard Galaxy Z Fold 6 is expected to bring some minor incremental upgrades, all eyes are undoubtedly on the Galaxy Z Fold 6 Ultra. However, here's the catch. The Ultra isn't expected to get a global release. But don't worry, it seems this powerhouse of a device won't be restricted to just Samsung's home country, South Korea. According to the folks over at Android Headlines, the Galaxy Z Fold 6 Ultra could also be launching in China. This is particularly interesting because it seems the rumored Galaxy Z Fold 6 Slim, which we've been hearing about with its slimmer body, bigger displays, and larger battery, might actually be the Chinese variant of the Fold 6 Ultra. If this is true, it would clear up some of the confusion we've seen in recent weeks about how many models Samsung is actually working on. It might just be two. The Galaxy Z Fold 6 and the Galaxy Z Fold 6 Ultra, the Ultra, limited to Korea and China for now, would allow Samsung to gauge interest levels before potentially bringing it to a wider audience. In China, the Z Fold 6 Ultra may be sold as the Samsung Go U25, complete with unique visual touches like decorative engravings on the hinge, similar to previous Samsung Gilead smartphones. And here's another interesting tidbit. China might also get the Galaxy Z Flip 6 as the W25 Flip. This is speculative at this point, but it aligns with rumors that Samsung is also working on a Galaxy Z Flip 6 Slim. Now, unfortunately, there isn't a lot of detailed information about what exactly the Galaxy Z Fold 6 Ultra will offer compared to the Z Fold 6, this is probably because the Ultra model isn't launching alongside the standard model, but we can expect more details to emerge once the standard Galaxy Z Fold 6 goes official at Samsung's Galaxy Unpacked event next month. Samsung's Galaxy Unpacked events are always full of surprises and we can't wait to see what they have in store for us this time. Will the Galaxy Z Fold 6 Ultra live up to the hype? Will it bring groundbreaking features that set apart from the standard model? Only time will tell. To be an upgrade. While rumors suggest a larger display and a slimmer design, the lack of S Pen support might be a deal breaker for some users. Ross Yanon also mentioned that production for the Z Fold 6 Ultra's display panels might begin later this year, with a launch expected in January alongside the Galaxy S25. This staggered release makes sense. It avoids competing with the July launch of the regular Fold 6 and keeps the Ultra exclusive to South Korea for now, which might frustrate international buyers. Speaking of launches, rumors suggest the next Galaxy Unpacked event might be happening on July 10th in Paris, France. However, Tipster E-Leak's list of expected reveals didn't include the Galaxy Z Fold 6 Ultra. Does this mean no Fold 6 Ultra this year? Probably not. E-Leak's list might only include devices long leaked photo a few days ago, looks a bit cheap and out of place on a flagship smartphone expected to cost over $1,500. The device in the picture also appears to be wider than the current Galaxy Z Fold models, suggesting that Samsung is increasing the display size. However, the screens won't be significantly bigger. Samsung is reportedly saving the major display size upgrade for the Galaxy Z Fold 6 Ultra and Galaxy Z Fold 6 Slim models, which are rumored to launch alongside the standard Z Fold 6 this year. Now, let's move to the front. The first hands-on image of the Galaxy Z Fold 6 has leaked and reveals that Samsung has finally listened to Galaxy Z Fold users. The new foldable phone will feature a wider cover screen compared to the Galaxy Z Fold 5. Reliable tipster Ice Universe shared this full image showing the front of the device and comparing it to the Galaxy Z Fold 5. As you can see, the upcoming foldable phone will have a wider cover screen that matches the width of the Galaxy Z Fold 5's cover screen plus one of its bezels. This wider cover screen should improve the typing experience on the Galaxy Z Fold 6 and resolve aspect ratio issues in some apps and games. The new foldable also appears to have much sharper corners for both the body and the cover screen. A tipster shared a photo that seems to show a new camera module for the Samsung Galaxy Z Fold 6. Although the leak only indicates that the camera module will feature a new design, it's doubtful Samsung would implement a design change without also upgrading the camera hardware. Here we have the first look at the new Galaxy Z Fold 6 outer display. A Twitter user named Ali recently shared a render comparing it to the Galaxy Z Fold 5. According to Ali, the new outer display features a boxier design and a slimmer hinge, significantly enhancing a Fold 6's overall appearance. The most noticeable difference between the Fold 5 and Fold 6 is the wider cover display. The render clearly shows what do you think about these changes? Are you excited about the wider cover screen and new design? Let us know in the comments below. 
Don't forget to like, subscribe, and hit the bell icon to stay updated with all the latest tech news. Thanks for watching, and we'll see you next time.